Hi and welcome to the video, I'm Dame and this is Dame Over and today in Battlefield 1 we're taking a look at the CTE again and at one of the assault weapons, the SMG 08-18, also known as the Maxim SMG. So if you guys enjoy this video at all or you find it useful then I'd be really grateful if you could hit that like button. So let's get on with it. So the SMG 08 18, I've got to find a better way of talking about it, the Maxim SMG is actually a lot of fun to use. It's basically, as according to the description, a scaled down version of the Parabellum which has become a big favourite amongst those who use the support class. It's got a massive 81 rounds in the magazine and as you can see they're all stored in this massive box on the side. And if we take a quick look at the stats you can see that it's actually the slowest firing SMG yet to come out in Battlefield 1. Now you might think this is a bit of a disadvantage but I didn't find it so when I was playing with this weapon. What the hell? How am I speaking so archaically? Anyway. The damage per shot is surprisingly high and it works in a very similar way to the MP18 with an emphasis on the use of hip fire because of the level of control. I found it to be a good answer against medics and supports up to about mid range as the extra damage per shot helps you shut them down very quickly and if you're good at trigger tapping and concentrating on burst fire you shouldn't struggle too much. And having such a large magazine means if you are pushing into close range, going around corners pre-firing means you'll stand an excellent chance of winning the encounter as you'll be able to get your shots in first. The visible recoil doesn't actually seem that drastic when you're going from short to mid range but even at those longer ranges if you pull down a bit then you should be able to hit your target quite easily. Now obviously there's got to be some sort of trade off considering it's got 81 bullets in the mag like I've mentioned before and that means that the reload speed is actually very slow. This luckily isn't much of a disadvantage as I found you can go minutes at a time without a reload being entirely necessary. Where this weapon excels is when you're on the defensive. It works at its best when you can force the enemy to go through a choke point or you've got a power position that you can keep moving around in to keep them guessing where you're going to come from. The slow fire rate means that you quite often have to get your shots off first to win the fight. And if you do that you're more than guaranteed to get the kill. What I found difficult to fight against was those assault troops that were pushing in with a shotgun or automatico or when I was flanked myself. Turning on opponent doesn't really leave you that much room for error as the kill time is slower than some of the other SMGs. As I mentioned before this SMG is actually a lot of fun to use. It encourages a high intensity high action playstyle. Because of the large magazine you'll be ducking in and out of cover, finding new doorways, trying to find power positions over and over again if you're on the defensive especially. And similarly to using an LMG with support class you won't feel like you have to back down from a fight so you can stop to reload. All in all I think it's a good addition to the assault class as everyone seems to just be stuck on using the Hellregal so hopefully this option changes the way people play and will expand the experience somewhat. So those are my thoughts on the SMG 08 18 or better known as the Maxim SMG which I really should remember to call it but what have you guys made of it? Let me know down in the comments below I'd like to know what you think. So if you had a good time make sure you hit that like button if you're new around here hit the subscribe button too and feel free to share this video with whoever and wherever you like and until next time that's game over peace